Hey, let's play. Welcome back to some more WWE SmackDown vs. Raw 06 with your boy Hero That Call Me and the other boy, Slain Bayonets. He's over there, still representing his Queen Park Rangers. <laughs> hey. What jersey is that? This is the away kit. That is ugly. Ignore that. Ignore that. That, that is an ugly kit. Yellow, dark blue, and whatever the fuck blue teal that is there we go so welcome back i'm here to call me that's a gay bumblebee over there but it's all right. <laughs> 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 all right so uh last week uh you guys saw it calum had himself a pay-per-view which uh did pretty well for him this is not his pay-per-view this is his pay-per-view there you go he had uh william regal win the title and it was amazing because it was in blackpool england and then immediately stripped him of the title and the fan support wow. looks like this. 7,175,000 for Raw, 2,825,000 for SmackDown. And we're leading up, building up, I should say, these next two weeks to SummerSlam, which is a dual brand pay-per-view. It'll be the first time we ever had one of those. So that should be fun. But, of course, I am in Helena, Montana to start things off. So whenever you're ready, we'll uh, rock I on. will just say, he had the chance to retain the belt. Yeah, but you put him against John Cena. You didn't even you didn't even put John Cena in a match to like prove that he was worth it. It was like I'm just gonna put the title on the line. Right Oops. away. You're like, I gotta get this title <laughs> off this guy. Because no one believes William Regal could be World Heavyweight Champion. He had his chance. I would I would have treated him way better. No, you wouldn't. Yeah, I would have. I'm gonna put if I was ever a show in Montreal, I'm putting the belt on Silver Ground, yeah. Oh hell no. It has to be every La Resistance member against like the <laughs> champion. <laughs> but they can't all win the title, unfortunately. I could do like uh, a manager match. I could do. I it, wonder if I could do a singles with manager and a special guest referee. <laughs> That'd be great. All right. Somebody say three minutes. Yep. Three more in HLA. All lesbian action. They got squished by Rosie and Jamal. It's great. <laughs> if any, they were in this game. <laughs> like, I can do it. I got four lays on my on my, on my roster. Jesus. That's not what I meant. <laughs> anyway, three, two, one. All right, let's rock and roll. Check the rivalries. Everything is going well. This is still going on. Goddamn, Kane Batista. You guys just won't quit. Uh, Robin Dam is content. What does he want? Losing every week? It's not my fault, man. You got to fucking win a match. Batista, same thing. Yeah, well, stop losing. It'll be fine. Um, five weeks. Five weeks for Stacy and Tori. I'll see what I can do with that later. Uh, main events, uh, we just had the title switch hands, right? In a Fatal 4-Way match. Let's do a singles with manager and manager. We'll do Hell's Favorite Demon with uh, with Satan, also known as, uh, not Christian. Chris Benoit, is he on the other side? He is on the other side. Chris Benoit, Chris Benoit, there you are. And we'll do Shawn Michaels. Triple H as his manager. There you go. Match five. Let's do a backstage brawl. Batista and Kane. Trying to get these two to kill each other. Doesn't seem to be working very well. Let's do main event hype for the promo here. Match four. Um, what do I do? Do a main event. Let's do a submission match. Not Ric Flair. I want Rob Van Dam versus Chris Jericho in a submission match. Uh, match three, let's do the, just a single, let's do a fatal four-way actually. Fatal four-way between Christian, uh, where are you at? Is he already in the match? No, Robert Conway, Ric Flair, and Steven Richards. I'm going to put the IC title on the line, why not? Match here, let's do a tag team match with the ladies. Tori with Lita it doesn't really matter because you know they're all in the same match. So I don't really care who's feuding with who here. Trish and Stacy on the same team. Trish and Stacy. I'm gonna start a undercard feud that's probably not gonna do me any favors, but we're gonna start it anyways. Um, Hurricanes 29. Who's got the best popularity? Mark Jandrak is 20. I want to get Sylvan Grandier's popularity, but he's gonna lose. I know he's gonna lose. Let's put him against. Uh, let's put him against Spike Dudley. Why not? That's going to do a half a star, if anything. Uh, that will be your card for this week. I'm going to try to sign Trish and Stacy real quick. 
couple five-week contracts for them. Whose contract is coming up that needs like a bigger thing? Batista, get him three months. Uh, Benoit, I'll get him three months. Just gotta keep an eye on my cash, obviously. And we'll do. Ooh, ooh these guys are gonna be expensive. I'll do three months with you. Okay. No, I was just signing people. Don't worry about it. What are you doing? Sorry. Looking at your emails. Sorry. Cheater. Sorry. Sorry. You ready? If you want, you want me to yep. count you down, I'll count you down. Three, two, one, go, cheater. Buddy, go, you bastard. <laughs> anyway. Alright. So. Uh. John Cena has decided uh, he's going to put William Regal up to the test. He's going to hide. Uh, and he's going to be hiding behind Booker T. So there we go. Uh, actually. That's not going to be the main event. Edge and Horn is going to be the main event. For the belt again, because why not? Put it in the main. This is going to be a manager match. So, Cena, Booker, Regal. Uh, main event hype, why not? Angle and the big show. Mysterio and Jibble. Uh, Benjamin and Guerrero. And then a four way match. It's going to be Davari. Uh, Paul London. Uh, Chava Guerrero. And Tajiri. And that's going to be for the belt, because why not? Yep, 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 yep. Alright, so Helena Montana. We got the uh, match of the, the century here. Sylvan Grind versus Spike uh, Dudley. A combined 25 in popularity. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's pretty bad. If, uh, like... if Sylvan Grindy loses here, I might just release him at this point. And Spike Dudley. For that matter. It doesn't matter if Spike wins or loses. I'm probably going to release. <laughs> so we'll see what happens. Well, there you go, Sylvain. It's your own downfall. No, I'm going to build him up. I'm going to do my best lose, to build him up. Lose the leaves. I'm going to do my best like, to build him up. Crap. I don't know how, but I'm going to do my best to build him up. You got to build him up from the ground up. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, match two, Alita and Tori Wilson beat Trish Stratus and Stacey Keebler in a tag team match. That's that HLI. Ric Flair is your Intercontinental Champion. As he beats oh. Christian Robert Conway and Stevie Richards in a fatal four way. Uh, Twitter went like that one. Not really what I wanted, but it is it is what happens. I kind of just wanted Christian to win or Robert Conway, but whatever. Uh, match four Rob Van Dam beats Chris Jericho in a submission match. Of course he does. That uh, famous Rob Van Dam submission. Yeah, the uh, 420 the... squeezeplex. <laughs> That's the first thing that came to my head. I don't know what a squeeze plex sure. is, but now I want to find out. Sure. Match five, Batista beats Kane in a backstage brawl. Good, because Batista was like, why can't I win? And he finally won. A cup of coffee. There you go. There was a Kane that was complaining that he can't win. I can't remember. It was one of the two. And the main event, Shawn Michaels beats Undertaker with Triple H. Uh, and Undertaker with the uh, help of... Oh, uh, the Dead Men. Yeah, the Dead Men. Exactly. That's, that's the point. <laughs> that was the point of that tag team right there. All right. Kicking things off with a fa oh my god! <laughs> oh, don't worry, let's go. A fatal four-way cruiserweight title match. Uh, that was one person I didn't want to win. <laughs> I would have preferred uh, Not great. I think it's under thirty. <laughs> as is Chavo's. Jeez. And then London and Shigeri were like at least over fifty. Rough. Oh uh, yeah. Well, ignore that. Move on to match two. <laughs> Benjamin with another win, I think. Yep. Or did two he win last week? I can't remember. Yeah, yeah. There you go. Two in a row. Two, two in a row. <laughs> two in a row, row, row. Your boat. Ray Mysterio <laughs> with a win over JBL. Kurt Angle with a win over Big Show. So both challengers winning this week. Uh, John Cena has decided 
he's not gonna he's not gonna play William Regal's games. Yeah. He's gonna hide. All right. He's got his uh he's got a back he's got some backup uh, once again. This is looking a bit familiar. I'll be honest. Yep. <laughs> uh, but, but Booker T. Booker T. Booker T. Uh, just the APA. That's all he is. He's done. He's he's uh he's done the job though, as he did before, yep. getting the win over William Regal. I want to point out as well, Regal's popularity. The first week he won the belt, about 46, 47. Yeah, it went up. I saw. Now, thirty two. That he lost the belt. Rough. That's what you get. So, you didn't push him. You got that huge boost behind him of fans, and you're like, no, let's not push him. Let's take the belts off him. And then hey. he's falling back down. I As I you, said, he had his gun. <laughs> Which leaves the main event. That's Ooh, a smart another, another retention. Randy Orton's going to be 100 Orton. overall in like three weeks. He's already 91. Yeah, I know, that's what I'm saying. He's going to be like I'll 100 be overall. Intrigued. I'll be intrigued to see what he is this week. New champion, fan change raw again. He'll school thirty thousand. Well, so look at look at his screen, by the way. Well, we got evolution marks here. Yeah, yeah, it's true. <laughs> evolution. They're all evolution. Evolution. Rick Flair was not that ripped at this time period. Just saying. Look how ripped he is. Has he ever been that ripped? Uh, he's he was pretty big when he was when he was younger. He always he's yeah, always looked think... old though. Let's be honest. He always looked like he's been seventy. All right, so let's check the reports. Let's check those SmackDown results. Building staircases. He missed a step, but it's all right. Uh, one yeah. and a half star opener. A couple threes. You know, that's what you want to see. You want to see some threes across the board. That's uh, that's good. And then the main event of four. Only four. I'm surprised. I thought it would have done better. That, that might... Uh, the world title feud might have to go up here. <laughs> that's how worrying this is. You got to get William Regal to, or to win some fucking matches is what you need to, to be, do. To be fair, Benjamin and Guerrero are still quite over. What you should do is you should put Regal and Cena in a tag team together, and that way they could beat up on shitty players and elevate each other. <laughs> and then they'll just keep mad, they'll just keep losing. <laughs> They're losing to like Chavo and yeah. shit. Yeah. Oh my god, that'd be horrible. Oops. Oh. Raw results. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Zero! I've never seen a zero star match before. Oh my god. I love, I love how you got the first five star match, but also the first zero. zero star match. That's hilarious. Spike Deli was a seven ground A tag them on Twitter if you if you know what their Twitter handles, they're they're a zero star match together. Oh my god, you know that's awful. Is, that I you still got a won. zero star match, but you still beat me. Yeah, I did. I did. Two, two, two and a half, four, and a four and a half main event. Gotta love it. And the fan support, of course, seven million two hundred five thousand two million seven hundred ninety-five thousand. We're also like, this is go home week, isn't it? Yeah, it is go home yeah. week to SummerSlam. Oh boy! So, oh boy! Oh boy! And Bismarck, North Dakota. I don't know. I don't Dakota. know the North Dakota accent. I don't know Dakota. what they are. I'm just saying weird voices. Yeah. So when you're ready, I will uh, start my show and uh, not put Sylvan Grande <laughs> versus Spike Dudley as my main or my first match ever again. <gasps> put it, put it in the main. No way. Then you'll definitely win. Hey, I'll, I'll take any win at this <laughs> point. <laughs> All right, three, two, one, go. All right, uh, rivalries. This is going strong. This is gonna be sour just before SummerSlam, isn't it? Oh my god. Uh, yeah, all the rivalry is going well. Uh, let me check for you to see real quick. I'm just curious. Like, popularity wise, Ronald Jordan's a 50, really? That's surprising. Um, I could pick him up and bring him in. I don't really feel like it, though. Uh, check my roster. Fatigue levels are okay. Got a couple of content people. Jericho losing every week. Yeah, that's what I figured. Jericho probably the same thing. Oh, he wants the title shot. You know what? Sure, why not, Jericho? I'll put you in the title picture. I don't give a shit. Shawn Michaels is content. Uh, thanks to the recent push on the program, the crowd is really getting behind me. We should consider negotiating a new contract. Yeah, I will do that right now. Uh, three months for you, buddy. There you go. I'd be happy. Okay, so let's do main events. Um, you know, I'm just gonna do a. I'm gonna do singles. Shawn Michaels. Yeah, perfect for the title. Why not? Because that might be the blow off right there. And then I'm gonna do a singles between. Undertaker and Benoit. Why the hell not? 
you know, just advertising promo. Actually, let's do, let's do a pay-per-view promo and a main event hype promo. Match four, we're going to do a main event battle royale, six man battle royale. We're gonna do Stevie Richards, Rob Van Dam, Batista, Kane, Ric Flair, and Jericho. I'm gonna put the title on the line, the IC title right there. We have a singles match here between Christian and Conway. There, we're gonna have a singles with managers for the ladies. Stacy, Tori, Trish. And here I'm gonna have a steel cage triple threat match. <laughs> Why the fuck not? Spike Dudley, get in here, baby. Hurricane. Silver Grande. <laughs> Why the fuck not, right? Oh, what a terrible match. Um, let's see if I can get some more people under contract here. I don't want to waste all my money, but I want to get them under deals before it's too late. Uh, that's fine. That's fine for now. Do, 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 do. Wait till you see my opener. You're going to love it. <laughs> it's not Spike Dudley and Silver <laughs> Grande. I'm disappointed. I, I, that's, I could hear the little laughing. <laughs> uh, right. You ready for your show in, oh. in Deutschland? I'm not because I'm holding the wrong controller. Of course you are. Was that a Wii? Oh, Wii? Not a Wii. <laughs> Fucking Nintendo Switch no, controller. That's, that's my Xbox controller. Oh, okay. Like, that's the one that came with the console. Yeah. All right, Germany. All right. Uh, yeah, 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 good. I don't think he's in this game. Yep. All right. Uh, he is. This so, is. is uh, I don't know if he was in like the GameCube ones, but this is only like SVR game. All right. Three, two, yeah. one. All right, God knows how I'm gonna book this. Uh, we're gonna have ourselves a six-man tag. It's gonna be the world champion, his new bodyguard, and his rival taking on Davari, Carlito, and Chris Masters. That's the world champ, by the way. That's our world championship feud. All right, and then uh, we're going to have Edge and Tajiri taking on Paul London and Randy Orton. We'll see how that goes. Uh, this is going to be... Actually, no. No, 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 no. Let's make this Shelton and Edge against Eddie and Randy. There we go. That's more like it. And then this will make this uh, Kurt and Big Show. Let's go pay per view hype. Excuse you. Uh, this is gonna be Stereo and JBL. Did I book a second match? I did not. Uh, this is gonna be Tajiri and Paul London. And then this is gonna be Eugene. Muhammad Hassan. Oh boy. Yeah, let's check this. Nothing there. We'll grab Hassan for another couple weeks, and then everything else is good there for now. He's on a free agency. We could grab Heidenreich, but he's not that popular. Orlando Jordan might be an eventual shout. Are there any other cruiserweights? Charlie Haas? Oh, I can't even look. Uh, oh, info. He's a light heavyweight. I don't know if that counts. 
Snitsky, obviously not. Scotty Sue Hardy, he's a light heavyweight. I don't mind those short. We'll see. I guess you get to see my match that I made. <laughs> my hey, a half star match. <laughs> I'm hoping, at least. <laughs> uh, now they have a total of like fucking 40, because Hurricane's 20, so they got that going for them. Uh, Bismarck, North Dakota, starting things off with Spike Dudley Hurricane Silver Grande in a goddamn steel cage match. Spike Dudley even, with oh. the victory. What the fuck, Sylvain? You suck. You're terrible. I didn't even see the stipulation. Yeah, dude. Triple threat cage match. <laughs> oh, God. He's you so bad. Win, just face off like that. Yeah. Uh, Stacey Keebler with Tori Wilson beats Lita with Trish Stratus managers. Uh, Christian beats Robert Conway in just a basic ass singles match. Batista's your new Intercontinental Champion in a big time six man battle royale. Hey, you know, Richards, Ric Flair, RVD, you know the big he's on Jericho. Sunday, right? Yeah, yeah, I do know, but I, I wanted to get the title <laughs> off of my tag team champion. That's why I did yeah. that. <laughs> also, Chris Jericho wanted a title match, and I just felt like it would be easier to do IC match than a tag team match. So, put all these feuds together. Uh, match five, Undertaker beats Chris Benoit clean, and then in our main event, this is what I'm worried about because we're about to go into SummerSlam, and my Triple H Shawn Michaels feud is three thumbs up, which means it could go by SummerSlam, and that would suck. But Shawn Michaels is the new WWE champion as he beats Triple H again for the title. I'm pretty sure that's why he won his Fair first enough. title it was beating Triple H, but I could be wrong. And we'll move over to All SmackDown. Right. So he's doing it. He's doing here's, it. Here's your go home feud. Uh, here's your go home match for the World Heavyweight Championship feud. We're signing right. Yes. yes! <laughs> Davari. Davari. Cruiserweight champ, by the way. Yeah, hell yeah, he is. I just remembered. He's the man. Uh, speaking of cruiserweights, Paul London with the win over Jerry. So we'll see what so happens. And if they even have a match on Sunday, we'll see. Uh, Muhammad Hassan with a win over Eugene. They're both still somehow pretty popular. Mm, people like Hassan's like a. I think they're both like. I think Eugene's a 55. Hassan's like a 61 going into this, so. It's not terrible. Mm -hmm. uh, Rey Mysterio. Rey Mysterio the win over JBL. Again? Don't know what my phone just vibrated for. Yeah. Yeah, it's two in a No, I'm like, he's won two in a row now, oh. I think, right? Yes. And then Big Show with a win over Kurt Angle. To Big Show now, 2-1 and one over Kurt. Oh. Which leaves the main event. Which I have half forgotten. I'm assuming it's... It's, it's big, Orton, though. Orton and Edge, would be my guess. Sean Benjamin and Edge Ooh. with the win over Eddie Guerrero and Randy Orton. So unless my shitty opener cost me, I think I won this week. <laughs> <laughs> That's a big main event, though. Well, we'll see. It's it's a big main event. I'm not saying it will, you know, beat your main event. Yeah, I'm not saying it beat your. Wow, well, okay. twenty thousand. <laughs> oh no, Eugene's upset. Yeah, hey, come on over, Eugene. We'll fix you. We'll fix your head. SummerSlam is coming up. Yeah, uh, it is. That's a, that's a okay. big. That's a big brand. Oh, you want to read it? Yeah, read yeah. it out loud. Oops, that's oh. not what I want. Reports. Ah. I don't think we can go back to it, can we? Uh, news. News. It's news. Boom, there you go. Read that. SummerSlam is coming up. SmackDown and Raw will be on the same card for the first time since WrestleMania, which we haven't booked. No, not yet. You can be sure the general managers will be... Yeah. <laughs> you can be sure the general managers will be putting on the best show possible. This is their chance to show off their brand and sway fans to tune into their weekly show. Yeah. One of them, anyway. Yeah. You can count on some big matches at this event, like William Regal and John Cena. <laughs> and Sylvain Grenier yeah. versus the Hurricane. No, Sylvain Grenier versus fucking Spike Dudley. Hell in a Cell. <laughs> oh, Jesus Three Christ. stages of hell. Yeah, there you go. So look at the reports. Not a bad show. Just wow. not, not a good main event. Hey, you know what? What? It's probably my... In terms of the actual structure, that might be my best book show yet. <laughs> well, here Just we go. Some real, some real sick stairs. Oh, 
There's an interesting Ooh. staircase. The ha- we got a half star though. That's a, that's an improvement from last yeah. time. <laughs> Hurricanes Stacey, over, yeah, Stacy Keebler, you know, you got Christian and Rob, uh, uh, Robert Conway not doing well for me, but that uh, IC title match did pretty good. Undertaker, Chris Maul with no fucking build at all, did me three stars. Gotta love that. And then uh, Shawn Michaels beating Triple H in just a basic ass singles match. It was almost a five star match. No, uh, I did see in the emails there there was a special email. Yes, yes, there was. We give you that if I you feel want. Like- I feel like as it's a special email, the one time we can allow to see it. SummerSlam is approaching. This will mark the first cross-branded pay-per-view of the year. The two shows will not face off, but I will be interested in seeing uh, which show puts on the better matches. The show with the most fans before the pay-per-view will get the last match on the card. Aw. Yeah, Thanks, Wanda. Vince. Thank you, Vince. Ah. So next week, as we see, we have 7,325,000 to 2,675,000 fans. Next week will indeed be SummerSlam, which is a six-match event, and we each get three matches each. Venice and Beach. we are going to be watching every match. So for every cross-brand pay review, we'll be watching matches, so I hope you guys enjoy that uh, shenanigans. That'll probably go live on uh, YouTube. Live, I mean, as in a, a fucking uh, live VOD, not a stream, because uh, I'm not doing a stream on YouTube. That ain't happening. Uh, but that is going to be interesting to see what happens, and uh, we'll probably be sitting there for at least an hour, would be my guess. Um, so, if you guys enjoyed this video, tell us uh, what you thought about it in the comment section below. Uh, leave a like. Obviously, uh, uh, pump, pump the tires for William Regal to become the World Highway Ch- uh, Champion again, because that's what matters in this world. And we will catch you guys next week for Summerfest. <laughs> Until next time, here at Club for Life, Swedish.